Ben, playoff season has finally arrived. It's knockout football time. York City Knights coming to the Shea on Sunday. You must be excited by the prospect of getting the business end of the season underway. Yeah, definitely. Um, we've had a good season, um, but we can't just uh, play off back of that. We need to perform how we've done uh, throughout the season and kick on in these playoffs uh, with some good form. We've beaten York twice so far this season, home and away, but how, you can't really take anything for granted when it comes to the playoffs. Anything can happen, can't it? Yeah, definitely, as it says, can't take no for granted. Uh, knockout rugby is what it is on the day. Whoever turns up and wants it the most. So yeah, it's a different type of different type of rugby playoff stuff. So whoever completes at that that high level will probably end up winning the game. Obviously, you've played at Super League level in the playoffs. You played at Championship level in the playoffs last season with the club um, how much of that experience can you take into a game like this knowing what it takes to come out of the other side and progress yeah take a lot into it um, obviously we've got some young lads in our squad haven't we um, so I can give them a bit of, bit of knowledge on how it is what it's like to play in them uh, it's a different style it's as I say whoever completes completes at that high level um, probably be on the way to, to winning game it's a home playoff tie, obviously down at the Shea. How much do you think that'll have a bearing on on the result and and how things go? You know, having home field advantage can go a long way in these playoff games. Yeah, definitely. Um, that's what we wanted to set a goal at the start of year um, to get that to get that home game for first round of playoffs. And I say fans have been been class for us all year. They've got behind us, so hopefully they can turn up this weekend and put in a good performance for them.